So the Aggies went ahead and got themselves a 2024 quarterback commit and three-star quarterback Anthony Maddox. So this kid has actually been pretty highly recruited by a lot of the top teams in the country, but he's only a three-star kid. But as we should all know by now, the recruiting rankings are just a rough estimate of what type of recruit that this kid is. You could be a three-star recruit and actually be a five-star. What a throw! Hold on a second. Look at him just bow. Rifle that ball in there, okay? Hey, my guy Anthony Maddox, yo, he's got a cannon for an arm. Wait a second. This dude can flat out spin it. I see now why there's been so many teams that have wanted to get his signature. This dude can flat out spin the ball. He's got the velocity, he's got the arm strength, He's got a little bit of mobility. Oh, no, nah, my guy, he's out here dotting these guys up. And he's got that quick release, too. That's what you always need to see. The quick release, to me, like, between a guy who could throw his 65 yards, 70 yards in air, or a guy who can only throw it 50 yards but has a quick release, I'm taking the guy, the guy who has a quick release every single day. That quick release comes in such handy. Yeah. Let Anthony Maddox go to Texas A&M, work on his fundamentals a little bit, get his footwork and his throwing mechanics a little bit more consistent, and you guys got a serious quarterback on your hands. This guy, he just really, he's in the same vein as a Jalen Hurts or Lamar Jackson. All the athleticism in the world, all the arm talent in the world, it's just about how willing, are, how willing and how dedicated are you to perfecting your craft as a quarterback because the quarterback position is only getting more and more advanced year by year, as well as what you're asked of as a quarterback with the mobility aspect as well. You need to be bringing it all. I feel like he has the capability to be that. He has the capability to be a top tier quarterback in in the SEC, to be a top tier quarterback for the Aggies. It's just about how much work is he willing to put in because that arm is live. And then his ability to be able to take off and get that first down, hey. I like that he keeps his eyes downfield too. A lot of quarterbacks right there would have just looked to take off, but he kept his eyes downfield. Okay, my guy Anthony Maddox has a ridiculous amount of upside. Again, I, I think that he's got to get that footwork a little bit more consistent, but that arm talent. You simply cannot just find that live of an arm in each and every single recruiting class. You might get one or two guys who can spin the ball for real, but to be able to spin it like that and have the command over the ball like that, not a lot of people can do that. Now it's about how willing is he to get that ball, to get that consistency with that mastery over the ball. Because Texas A&M and Alabama were his two biggest offers. Like, think about that. He like everybody else is kind of sleeping on him, but the teams that really know how to recruit, they're offering him. All I know is that Anthony Maddox has a ton of upside. All my Aggie fans, keep an eye out on him because he can, he can seriously bring y'all to a new level. I'm just letting y'all know that right now. But comment down below, what are you guys' thoughts on Anthony Maddox, new three-star, ridiculously talented quarterback, as well as leave this video a like and hit that subscribe button and turn notifications so you never miss any of the fire recruits that we bring you, as well as other college football news. And don't forget to click the link at the top of the description to redeem your 150% deposit bonus with BUSR and to also make your bets for the Super Bowl. It's coming up this weekend, so you don't want to miss out on that. I love and appreciate all y'all. Hope that you have a super blessed rest of your day, and I'll catch you.